Uh, okay, Tut. You only here to pick up your stuff. You are not here to sleep with her. Like the last time, and the time before that, and the time before that. Woo! You think at a certain point I would just learn my lesson? She just know how to seduce a fish. One minute we talking about sunflowers and easy bake ovens. Then the next minute I'm driving over to CVS to pick up a Plan B pill. Like, why do I do this to myself? I think I just love the toxicity it brings into my life. You know, yin and yang. It got to balance out. Okay, pep talk. You are a strong, independent, manly man fish, Tut. You don't need no Sandy, no Sandy's cheeks. What'd your mama tell you? You are as handsome as Poseidon made you in his image. Hmm. That man got another five seconds before I told his shit. Five, four, three. Ah, close enough. <laughs> I love my job. Pissing people off. It made me happy. Hey, 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 what you doing to my boat, man? What it look like? I'm towing your shit. Towing? Why? I ain't number five months late on my payments. All right, I'm supposed to get another courtesy month and an intimidating phone call before they send you to come get my shit. Nah, I ain't here for all that. You parked illegally, sir. I gave you a minute grace period to fix your mistake, and you didn't do it. So in result, I'm towing your shit. Illegally parked? Man, what you talking about? All I did was pull in. I'm not parked next to a fire hydrant or a crosswalk or over top of a guppy who was innocently crossing the street. God, risk that poor guppy soul. Uh, anyway, um, so please do explain to me how am I illegally parked right now? Because to me, it seemed like you just wanted to come over here and give me a hard time. Are you having a bad day, sir? Did you wake up on the wrong side of the rock? Patrick, look at... All right, I'm sorry. Your hair just reminded me of my neighbor's physical feature. Uh, so yeah, did you need a hug or something? A shoulder to cry on? Cry on my shoulder. It's okay. Come here. Come here. Don't touch me. Back up. You don't know me like that, man. Back up. Okay, I'm going to back the hell up. Can you please tell me how I'm illegally parked, though? My pleasure. Hmm. Well, your boat is parked an extra two inches away from the sidewalk than the legal amount. Meaning a part of your boat is illegally parked in the middle of the street. Sound illegal enough for you? Illegal enough? No, it don't sound illegal at all. Sir, I'm going to need you to lower your tone when you speaking to me. You the one who came over here acting like I personally kicked you and your guppy maker and took the first bite of your birthday cake with the candle in the middle with your name on it. I'm a bikini bottom citizen and I know my rights. I'm going to need you to bring your, I pour the milk in the bowl before the cereal so it don't get soggy. Look at ass over here and detach my boat this very instant. Not five minutes from now, not next episode, right now as I'm into this sentence, period. Oh, you want me to come and detach it? You see, as much as I love to do that, <laughs> Bikini Bottom Law, under the towing and handling section 18-A, clearly states once the vehicle has been bought onto the truck, it cannot be lowered down until it has been escorted to the police lockup. You will have seven days. You know what? Since I really don't like your ass, you will have three days to collect your vehicle before it become crushed and recycled to make t-shirts. T-shirts? Wait. How y'all plan on making t-shirts out of recycled boats? Are y'all like switching around elements on some Bill Nye the Science Guy type shit? Turning metal into fabric? I may have failed chemistry, but I know enough to know that that don't sound right. Look, sir, I really don't know how they do it. It's a separate party that handles that. The only information I can provide you is giving you the customer service number and maybe give you my promo code to get you a shirt 50% off. Oh, damn, wait. You saying I can wear a shirt made out of my boat? Wait. I need my boat more than I need a damn recycled shirt. Look, my brother, how about I just slide you a crispy $20 bill and you just put my boat down? Nobody gotta know. And you just earned yourself an extra $20 that you ain't had 10 minutes ago. Boy, I get paid per boat. They pay me $100 a boat I bring in. You think I'm gonna settle for that busted ass 20? All right, okay, all right, fine. How about, uh, how about I raise your ante a little bit? How about $101? If you want me to break the law or risk my job, you're going to have to pay me way more than what you offering. All right, all right. Okay, okay, okay. You a bougie motherfucker, huh? Uh, name your price. I'll see what I can do. Run me 300 300 Like $300? Yeah, I said $300. You deaf or something? I don't like repeating myself. I'm damn near deaf from how much you yelling. I ain't running you no goddamn $300. You crazy. You better take your black Albert Einstein looking ass up out of here. I devised the theory of relativity and the sauce that your uncle used at the barbecue. Look at that, nigga. <laughs> How much is it going to cost to pick it up at the lot? $4,500. Oh, <laughs> you said $300, right? 
Three hundred just to put down my boat. Damn, man, you so generous, man. I appreciate your kindness. I'm, I'm for real. I'm for real, for real. Here you go. Let me just make sure I'm giving you the right amount. I ain't want to short you, my good brother. Uh huh. One hundred. Mhm. Two hundred. Three hundred. There you go. Three hundred dollars exactly. You know what? Since you're being so kind and generous, I'm gonna be kind and generous too. Here you go, another dollar, man. Now you got three oh one dollars. <laughs> See, I scratch your back, you scratch mine. Cool, cool, cool. Whenever you're ready, you can go ahead and uh, you know, drop my boat. I happily repark it and make that little two inch margin. You know, uh, uh, what you, what, what you waiting on? What you mean? What I'm waiting on? Um, I just paid you the money. Ain't you gonna uh, put my boat down? I'm sorry, sir, but unfortunately, it clearly states. In Bikini Bottom Law, under towing and handling, once the vehicle has been bought up, it cannot be bought down under any circumstances. My nigga, I just gave you $300. What $300? The $300 I gave you and physically seen you put in your goddamn pocket. Shit, I don't know what you talking about. Please stand back as I get into my tow truck and take your vehicle. Thank you, sir. Uh-uh, hold up. Hell no. I didn't want to have to use it, but I'm going to have to use it. You done messed up. You just had to bring the hood out of me. Uh-huh, uh-huh, yeah, what now? Drop my boat, nigga. Chitty, chitty, bang, bang. Fish is gonna die. Are you pointing a spray painted Nerf gun at me? You used the wrong paint. I can see the giant in on the side. And, uh, hmm. You see, you use metallic spray paint. That's why you got drips. It's just sliding right off. What you do need to use is an all-in-one. Now that, that right there will get the job done. Uh, wait, sir. Come on, man, please. You cannot be doing a nigga like this at the worst possible time. I'm here to pick up my stuff from my ex-girlfriend, right? I'm still madly in love with her, and just seeing her was giving me anxiety all day. Can you please just give me a break? Damn, man, I ain't know you was dealing with all of that. You want some words of advice? Uh, yeah, sure. Please. All right, man. What you want to do is buy her some flowers, some little chocolate-covered strawberries. You know what I'm saying? You following uh, yes, sir. Every word. All right. Once you got all that, you want to come knock on her door. Let her know you would like to have a conversation and ask her to come inside. Now, once you're inside, you're going to want to ask her to give you a ride to the police tow lot to collect your busted, rusted ass boat. Now, get off my face. I don't want to see you ever again. Oh, I swear. Why do I always got to deal with some bullfish at work? It's like every episode is another problem from another collab. I bet he don't even know what it's like. Hey, what you doing? Man, hell no, nah, you ain't taking my shit. I thought you was being considerate, trying to give me advice, and being literate. But you can't read my emotions. I'm going through a lot right now. Oh, like that? All right, uh, I got something for your ass. Yeah, that's that horsepower. I'm gonna take your ass to the lock with me if I have to. You ain't taking shit. I'm gonna drag your ass to, uh, I don't know where I'ma drag you, but just know I'ma be the one dragging you. Ah! 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 Come on, no! Stop! Oh! Hey! Oh! Oh shit! Hey! Hey, you got insurance? Man, hell no! Nah. I'm getting up out of here. You ain't never seen me, and I ain't never seen you. Never seen you? What you talking about? I'm currently seeing you right now with my two eyes, and I'm pretty sure your ass can see me. If not, then I'm a little worried about... Oh, I see what you're saying. Nah, nah, nah. I got you. I get what you mean. If anybody asks, ever, just say Sandy Cheeks did it. This was all her fault. Who Sandy? The person who did this nigga now run. Oh! 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 Hey! You must not joke when it comes to learning jutsu. It breaks concentration. So how in the hell do I let my chi flow through my body? Have you not seen anime? It's all about the dramatic screaming. Try it out! Yeah! <laughs> you give it a try, Tetsun. I have faith in you. Man, I can tell you never got in in school, huh? Ooh, I like this chain. It's just my type. I bet you got a lot of jewelry around this house somewhere, huh? Can we get a tour? Wait, um, is this chain real? Hell yeah, no, nah, this chain ain't real. But you know what I'm saying? I'm the realest fish you know. You know what I'm saying? As I got so much money, why would I spend my money on simple things like chains? You need to open up your mind, you know what I'm saying, to a whole new level. You know what I'm talking about? I ain't spending my money on chains. I'm spending it on... I'm investing. Yeah. Hmm. What kind of chain is that? Baby, you know what kind of chain this is. Look at the bedazzling diamonds, baby. You see that glisten the water. Just listen. Wow. 
Mm, okay, okay, wow. <laughs> it's just all over the place, baby. Get out my face. Let me see turn around. Lord, baby, this thing is round. Hey, what up? God damn you ugly as hell. Hey, hey, who approached somebody like that? Like, what if I was really self-conscious about my appearance? What? You want to cry about it with your ugly ass? Well, God damn, you aggressive. Well, maybe I will or maybe I won't. If I did, it would be yo, either I'm paying for Hulu or Netflix because I can't afford both. Looking at that fault. Then you had to continue your day knowing you ruined somebody else's day. Can you live with that? Huh? Can you? Hey, look, I'm completely comfortable with that. So yo, my boy. Where is your bathroom? Where is your bathroom? Where is yo? Where is your bathroom? Where is your bathroom? Where is your bathroom? Where is yo? I gotta pee like 